What? What, what, what? What the hell is this? Harumph, 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 harumph. I didn't get a harumph out of that guy. Give the governor harumph. Harumph. You watch your ass. I see you shiver with anticipation. Let the show begin. Hey, hey, everybody, this is David Heretic coming at you with another edition of Reactions, Reviews, and Rants. And tonight. Tonight! Oh, uh, now wait, now hold on. He, it, he's been on the channel before, but not as the lead. So I, I guess, I guess we'll go with that. Uh, making, well, not really as a, okay, not, a, not his official debut, but his solo debut. Making his solo debut on the channel tonight. Tonight! We have F Hero. Yes, indeed. How about that? F Hero making his solo debut on the channel. Before we go any further, for those of you who are feeling inclined to doing all of the clicks and the likes and the bibbity bibbity bob, do me a favor. Before you do all that stuff, Please watch the whole video first, okay? Give me a chance to actually earn those clicks and likes. Now, after the video's done, still feel like doing all those clicks and likes, then by all means, feel free to click away. This comes as a request from Bren, and this is actually Bren's prioritized request for the month of June for being a silver tier member on the Patreon page. So, here you go, Bren. Hope you enjoy the show, man. Bren wanted me to check this out. It is F Hero. Body Slam and Baby Metal all coming together on this one with a tune called Leave It All Behind. Now, have I heard the song before? No, I have not. To the best of my knowledge, this does not resonate with me in any way, shape, or form. However, there's always a possibility I may have heard the song in passing and I just don't realize it. So as always, if I start listening to the song and I suddenly go, wait a second. Yeah, I recognize this song. I'll let you know. That's the truth. You know me, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. This was posted by F Hero Official, okay? And the video has 3.1 million views. It'll get you there. Other than that, there's really nothing else left to say. Link to the original video will be down below in the video description for your viewing pleasure at your leisure. Let's get started. What do you say, are you ready? Are you ready? Because here we go. All right, here we go. F Hero X Body Slam X Baby Metal. Leave it all behind. Official music video. Wah, wah, wah. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Yeah, there's that word official. I, I don't know what scares me more the word official or the word baby metal. I, Either one of those is going to get you in trouble. I got to be careful with this. All right, let's do this. All right, boy, let's do this. ความเจ็บมันทิ้งไปโลดด่าน้อยใจแม่โชคให้อภัยในโทษตัวอาทิตย์ยังถูกใส่โทษทางใต้โคตรยาบขึ้นลงพี่โรดเธออาทิตย์
Very interesting. I like the trade off. So th there, there's been some serious trading off here. So the first verse, F Hero. Uh, first chorus um, was Baby Metal supported by, I guess the band here is, I guess that's Body Slam. Okay, so they're supported by Body Slam. Liked the harmonies afterwards. Coming back out of the chorus into the main riff, you had the F Hero line. But then the second verse, Baby Metal, pre-chorus, Body Slam, second chorus, Body Slam. So we're, we're trading off parts. I like it. it. It doesn't become stagnant. It doesn't become predictable. Uh, it's not it's not a copy and paste job, you know, it's not it's not control C control V aha solution You know, it's not that um, It's interchangeable. I like it. it. It shows it shows diversity. It shows the ability to uh, Be able to put into different places and adapt I like that um, It's not one trick pony ish. I absolutely appreciate it I've never heard of these guys. Body Slam. I I'm I, I got Look. Don't get me wrong. I like what Baby Metal's doing. I I do. I like what they've contributed so far. Uh this is obviously an F Hero song. He had the first verse. I like what he did there. I absolutely do. I got to be honest with you though. These guys here, at least for me, these guys are stealing the show. They absolutely are. I like what they're bringing. I like what they're doing. I like his vocals. Uh, what the guitar player was doing through the second verse with the tapping pattern that he had going on to reinforce underneath what was happening within Baby Metal's vocals. I like that. Uh, the drum pattern that the drummers come up with. I like that. Uh, their keyboard filling out the sound. I like that. These guys are stealing the show. They absolutely are. Um... Uh, I don't think I have any requests for Body Slam in the queue. I don't think I do. Um, if I don't, I, I'll, I'll give you guys a deadline. <laughs> I'll give you guys a month or two to put some requests in. Uh, let me see. This is coming out right now. It's April right now. This is going to be coming out in June, mid-June. So if I don't have any requests for these guys by like the end of August... I'm going to say too bad, and I'm going to go check them out on my own because the I, I'm really digging what they're doing. I really do. Um, let's keep going here.
Okay, I, I get it. The ending. I get it. Okay. Dang. <laughs> oh! Uh, hmm. Huh. <laughs> there's there's a lot of things going through my head right now. Um <laughs> I I need to sort everything out. Okay, let me get my thoughts together. I'll see you in the review and we'll talk about it. Well there you go, folks. That was F Hero Body Slam and Baby Metal with a collaboration song called Leave It All Behind. This was a request from Bren. And this was actually Bren's prioritized request for the month of June for being a silver tier member on the Patreon page. So there you go, Bren. Hope you enjoyed the show, man. Oh boy, I have a feeling this song is gonna be in trouble. I have a feeling this video is gonna be in trouble because I let this I let that song run for over two and a half minutes without pausing. So see, okay, here I don't know what worries me more. The official coming off of uh, F Hero's official page or the fact that Baby Melma is involved in any way, shape, or form, and which means Amuse's fingers are stuck in the pie somewhere. Uh, I, I don't know what I should be more afraid of. Uh, something tells me I should be more afraid of Amuse. I, 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 I can see it now. I can see it now. I edit the video, I upload it, and I get the notification from YouTube that the video's blocked, and it's, it's Amuse that's doing the block. I'll, I won't, I will not be surprised. I, I just won't be shocked at all. Um, <laughs> I don't I, I don't know how this is going to go. Um, I, I, I do know how my scoring is going to go, though. I absolutely know that. So let's get to that score, shall we? On a scale of 1 to 10, I'm going to give that an 8.4. Yep, 8.4. I feel good about that score. Let me tell you why. Why? Okay, first things first, 8.4. What does that mean? Well, an 8.4 would translate to a great scale rating. It would translate to four to five stars and an A minus letter grade. Yeah, so there you go. An 8.4, great scale rating, four to five stars and an A minus letter grade. Now, how did I come up with that score? <laughs> so glad you asked. Okay, from what I am gathering, I, 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 I could be wrong. I'm, make, I'm making some assumptions here just based on the limited information I have. From what I'm understanding, this is an F-Hero project, okay? This, this is his baby. This is his thing. This is his deal. And he recruited Body Slam and Baby Metal to be a part of it. Now, I don't know how he came around with, with Body Slam. I don't, I don't know anything about Body Slam. But I'll bet you anything, I know exactly how Baby Metal came into play. Baby Metal recruited F Hero for that song, uh, Papaya. Uh, they, he, they, request, they, they got him for that. And I'll bet you anything, I, I, I'm sure he was paid for his time, but I'll bet you anything, at, at some point he was like, you know what, I'll, I'm gonna do this for you girls. I, I'm, I'm gonna do this for Amuse, I'm gonna do this for you guys, but you're gonna owe me a favor. And I'll bet you anything, this is him going, hey, Baby Metal, remember that favor you owe me? I'm calling it in. You know, I, I'll bet you it was kind of like that. I'll bet you we have a Rocky Three moment right now. Apollo Creed looking at Rocky and go, you're going to owe me a favor. And poor Rocky sitting there going, what favor? You know, and at the end of the movie, you see what the, we see what the favor is. No spoilers. But, uh, you know, it, it's, uh, it, it's, it, it's interesting to see that. You know, here we are years later, literally years later, and... Uh, Baby Metal showing up on F Hero Project. Um, I thought that was really cool. Here's the thing that kind of confused me though. Um, it's an F Hero Project. It's his baby, it's his thing. But his time in the song was pretty limited. We had him in the first verse. We had him in the breakdown. And we had him at the very end and coming out of the first and second verse. Uh, with the with the with the line, uh, I believe that uh, yeah, leave it all behind. I believe that's what he said. His time, his role in this wasn't very big. I would say he had maybe twenty percent contribution to the song, where uh, Baby Metal and Body Slam were about forty percent each. It was pretty even between the two of them. 
which only leaves, like I said, 80%. That, that's 80%. That only leaves 20% for F Hero. I found that kind of odd since this is his project. Now, odds are what happens here is he was the producer. He probably produced this himself. So that's how he's getting the credit for it. And I, I, I get it. I absolutely get it. it it's his baby. So if, he, if he's going to put his name on it, it's his project and he's producing it, then obviously he's the star of the show. He should be. I just find it fascinating that he kind of stepped back and let the other two you know, entities shine. Now, let's talk about all the entities. F Hero's delivery, uh, I like the intensity. I absolutely do. Um, the first verse, nice bars he was putting out. The meter was good. Uh, the placement was good. The rhythmic patterns he was coming up were very nicely done. I had no issue with anything he was doing. Um, I was a little person, a little more impressed with this delivery on the main lines coming out of the, the, the first chorus, the second chorus. And then of course the build and the build and the build and the build coming out of that breakdown into the drop, really nicely done as well. Uh, baby metal. I mean, look folks, they're baby metal. What do you expect? I mean, you you, you got exactly what you were expecting. Um, you you had the, the melodic singing from, from Sue and from, uh, from, uh, Ah, why am I blanking right now? From Moa and Momo, Momo, that's the name. From Moa and Momo, you got the hip hop type of, uh, you know, spoken word uh, cont contribution. Exactly what you were expecting, you know what I mean? Um, and, and they did a great job, they absolutely did. But I'm just saying, there were no surprises there uh, on, on that delivery. The only surprise I got when it came to baby metal was the harmonization when when Sue and the lead singer from Body Slam would come together and harmonize. That was nice. I was not expecting that. And their voices actually blend really well together. Their their tones mesh really well together. Um, I I kind of hope baby metal and Body Slam. I mean, don't get me wrong. I I I got nothing against F Hero, but. I really kind of hope that Baby Mel and Body Slam do more work together. Now, if F Hero's in the mix too, great. All, all the more power to them. But I really kind of hope Body Slam and Baby, Baby Mel collaborate more because it, that's a good mashup. Um, but as far as Baby Mel's contribution, like I said, it was I, I had a I had an idea of what was going to happen, and yeah, it it pretty much came to pass. Body Slam. I've never heard of them. I've never knew of even knew of their existence uh really quick let me just check i should have done this before i started the review but let me just check really quick and see if they're even in the queue anywhere i don't know if they are let's see body slam nope there is nothing in the queue for them okay so here's the deal folks if you would like to expose me to more body slam i'm gonna give you until the right now okay this is where things get weird. I filmed six weeks in advance. Right now it's April. <laughs> um, and I know this video is coming out in June, like mid June somewhere. Here's the deal folks. I'm gonna give you until August, okay? If nobody makes any requests for Body Slam by August, the end of August, I'll give you, I'll give you to September 1st. If I don't have any requests in the queue for Body Slam by, by, by September 1st, I'm just gonna go on my own and I'm gonna look for these guys and I'm gonna find out more about them because I was very pleasantly surprised by them. They they were nice. I like their approach. I like their direction. I like their tone. I like their sound. The vocalist has got some pipes on him. He's, he's got a great singing voice. The guitar player's got some serious chops. Uh, the bass player and the drummer were locked in with each other. The keyboard was doing a nice job filling out the sound. Um, I'd, I'd be really curious to see what they can do on their own. So, like I said, I'll give you guys till September. If I don't have any requests in the queue for them by September, too late, you're out of luck. I'm gonna go on my own and find them and see what I think of them on their own. Uh, here's what really kind of impressed me about this. There was structure to the song, clearly, you know, verse, pre-chorus, chorus, verse, pre-chorus, chorus, breakdown, bridge section, build up, into a secondary breakdown, and then we ended out with the chorus. Okay, look, we, it, it, it's it's obviously structured. What I wasn't expecting was this. I kind of saw like, you know, verse, all verses would be handled by F-Hero. 
All choruses would be handled by Baby Metal. All pre-choruses would be handled by Body Slam. You know, I thought everybody was gonna be assigned a role. And I was very pleasantly surprised to see that the roles were interchanged for different parts. First verse, F Hero. And then uh, Baby Metal came in with the pre-chorus and the chorus one. And then second chorus, uh, second verse came in and we had Baby Metal take the lead primarily. And then second pre-chorus and chorus was primarily Body Slam. Um, it was nice to see those interchangeable parts and people filling in different roles. Okay, we're gonna take this verse and this chorus, you know? We'll take verse two and chorus one and or, or invert it around. And it, it, it was really interesting to see that. Um, it was kind of nice. It was kind of refreshing to see that because sometimes you'll see this collapse and it's very obvious, you know, one, one group takes care of the verses and one group takes care of the choruses. And it's just, it, it's just kind of like, eh, you know, it just kind of falls flat to me. Seeing it done like this, it was interesting because it, it kept you guessing. Who's gonna take the next part? I, I kept thinking, when's F Hero gonna come back in and take a, and, you know, take a verse or something like that? It, it, it kept me on my toes and it definitely kept me vested. So I absolutely appreciated that. Um, I would love to see if these guys go on tour together. Uh, in particular, Body Slam and Baby Metal. I don't know if F Hero would be involved in the mix. But if Body Slam and Baby Metal were ever to go on tour with each other, I'm sure they would pull this out. I'm sure they would. They'd get permission, obviously, from F Hero uh, to do it. Or maybe F Hero might even come along for the tour. But, I mean, it, it'd be interesting to see more of a collaboration, especially between Body Slam and Baby Metal. I still can't get over how well Sue's vocals and the vocalists from Body Slam, their tones just, when they would do their harmonies, it wasn't the notes that they sang. It was the their tone of voice. Uh, between the two of them really meshed well. So that could be a good collaboration to see more of in the future. So I think this was a great job. I, I really do. I, I, I think this was a great collaboration and, and a great effort on everybody's part. Um, I'm not gonna sit here and say that I was blown away, you know, or I was super impressed, but it was great and I was thoroughly entertained and I had a great time listening to this. So yeah, 8.4, I feel good with that score. And that's where we're gonna stay. So let's wrap everything up here in a nice shiny bow, shall we? We got an 8.4, which is a great skill rating, four to five stars, and an A minus letter grade. Take your pick, I don't care, whichever one of those floats your boat. Final word, final score, I have spoken. Well, that's gonna do it for this edition of Reactions, Reviews, and Rants. Hope you all enjoyed the show. Hope I was able to entertain you. If I was able to put a smile on your face and brighten your day, I did my job, and I'm so glad I could do it. If you guys feel like joining the fan base, go ahead and click on that button down there. If you guys wanna like the video, go ahead and like the video. If you guys wanna ring the bell, go ahead and ring the bell. It honestly doesn't make any difference at all to me, but if you guys feel like doing these things, well then by all means, feel free to do so. Well, that's gonna do it for tonight, folks. Thank you very much for watching, and as always, this is David Heretic signing off, reminding you to stay fabulous and support each other. Later, peace.